So today we're going to be building a two frequency geodesic dome out of card and for this project you're going to need three pieces of paper, uh, three pieces of card with the pentagon markings on them and you'll need one piece of card with triangle marked on it and these will be available for download in the description. So to start off with I'm just going to put these to the side. You'll also need a pair of scissors and a glue stick. And to do this process, the first thing we want to do is we just want to cut out along these outside lines. I'll just show you one for now. So we're going to do is we're just going to cut that out. And then along these lines here, we don't need these pieces. So we're just going to cut off these small triangle pieces and then what we want to do is we want to fold all of these um, along this black line here okay so now I've got a small batch of five triangles which are all cut out and folded and I'm going to show you how to glue these together into the pentagons so just take a bit of glue stick and the first thing to note is that we have these uh, black lines. We want to make sure that the two black lines are coming together. If you have a side of the triangle where the black lines don't come together, you can see it's far too long. Uh, so that won't be able to um, tessellate around to make a five-sided shape. So we just want to make sure that all of the black lines are pointing in towards the middle or that the black lines are connecting together. So here we have all of our pieces cut out and folded and the pentagons have been glued together. So we have six pentagons here and then we have ten of the yellow triangles. These triangles don't have a uh, mark or arrow on them because they are equilateral triangles. And so now we're ready to start gluing everything together. So I'm just going to make myself a little bit of room here. So the first thing we want to do is we're going to take one of our pentagon pieces and we're going to take one of our equilateral triangles and we're just going to apply some glue to the edge here and fix that on and again we're just trying to be careful to get our vertices as equally spaced as possible on both sides and we want to glue yellow triangles all the way around the outside of the pentagon so we'll have five yellow pieces hanging off like this to make kind of like a flower petal. And this is where it all starts to take shape and this is where it starts to get pretty cool. Okay, so you can see here we've got our five pieces attached around the edge and we've sort of got like a flower pattern or yeah, or a star pattern. Uh, and now what we're going to do is we're going to take this piece and we're going to glue it in here. So it's going to attach to two of our uh, yellow pieces like so. Let me just get that in frame a little bit better for you. So that's going to be the next step. I'm going to choose to apply the glue to the uh, pentagon. And you can see that we've done a fair bit of preparation work. But now things are going to start taking shape really quickly uh, and you're really going to start to see the results of your work, which is quite satisfying. And see how that fits in there? That's, I think that's pretty cool, if you ask me.
It's already standing up. I forgot one of my uh, pentagons, so let me just grab that quickly. Here it is. So you can see here we've got uh, the dome shape basically done and the last thing to do is just to add these five triangles in around the bottom like so. So I'll show you a few spots where we're going to add them. So basically just anywhere there's a gap, there'll be five gaps and one of these uh, yellow triangles will go in there. And I'll just uh, cut back once I've done that. Okay, and now we've completed our two frequency geodesic dome. That's all for this week's video guys, there'll be more like this coming up in the future, so if you enjoyed this then please remember to like, comment and subscribe.